minds are not ready for this kind of information. Concerned parents staging a sit out over a controversial change in curriculum in the San Juan Unified School District. The district is considering new history, social science materials featuring LGBTQ leaders. CBS 13's Adrian Moore with a compromise the parents want and how the district is responding. And finally, people are saying, you know, this is enough. We've had enough. So. Um, that's why we're out here. Standing up by sitting out. We want a change. We want them to change it. This handful of concerned parents pulled their children out of class in protest over recommended new history and social science curriculum in the San Juan Unified School District. Their argument the new material isn't age appropriate. But they have to talk about their sexual orientation as young as first grade, and we just feel like that's not age appropriate and it's too young to be talking about sexual orientation. The curriculum, according to district officials, is aligned with new legislation like the FAIR Act. So these new history social science materials include um, a wider representation of contributions of different groups of people, including those with disabilities, people from the LGBT community, as well as minority groups. But these parents say it's up to them to address anything sexual in nature and choose the time they see fit to have that dialogue. We don't like to appreciate the state forcing these sex programs in their health framework on us, on us, on, on our families. So is there room for a compromise here? Jenica Williams offered this up. There is a gray area in the law which says that, um, that it's up to the district and the schools how and when they implement these. And so that's what we're trying to push to the district is if they could just delay it to middle school to when they teach sex ed, you know, that's all we're asking for. Well, if the school board approves it, the new curriculum starts next school year. Now, the district is hosting a review night for any parents wanting to get a closer look at the materials. That's this Wednesday at 630 at San Juan High School. And this isn't the first local school district to get this new curriculum. Earlier this month, the El Grove Unified School District unanimously decided to adopt a curriculum featuring more ethnic and racial groups, including LGBTQ figures, in its updated textbooks.